there. It's, uh, my name is Jen, and this is my first video. And I'm thinking of doing these kind of videos, which is like how to regular home stuff. Um, I have extensive experience in cleaning hotels and houses and all types of things. And I don't do that anymore because I hated it. Um, so this is my first video and in this video we are going to clean um, the plastic dressers. Um, so if you hear meowing that's Nala. Mm. Say hi Nala. You're so pretty. Yes, you are. So pretty. So, here's the dresser. As you can see, it's pretty grody. That's, um, as you can tell with my finger here. It's not coming off. That is cigarette smoke. And, uh, Cigarette smoke is like, it sticks to everything. And when it sticks to everything, it's not good. A lot of times the smell and won't come out. And um, if you can see it, this is pretty yellow too. Like it, it looks kind of yellowed. And normally that's what happens with cigarettes is they they tint the stuff. No. Seriously. So, we're gonna clean this. Best way I know how. So, what you'll need is you'll need a tub. Tub. You'll need a scrub brush or I have we call this the crappy sponge and you'll want the scrubby part and I've tried many different cleaners my husband does not like the smell of bleach and I've actually got to know a couple people who don't like it either and even though I want to recommend that because it will get it white again. Nala. Seriously. Mm. What? I know. What? I know. Yeah. Everyone can see how pretty you are. What? That purple thing on her is a calming collar. It's like supposed to calm her down and obviously it's not calming her down because she's still like um so on to cleaners I love the smell of pine salt I use it on my wood floors I'll use it in my tub I'll use it everywhere because I, I love the smell of original pine salt and it works a lot better than the dollar brand dollar store stuff and um so I would use that, but it won't take the yellow tinge off of it. So uh, what we're going to use is uh, Simple Green. Mm. Simple Green. Mm. Uh, this one is half, like three-fourths Simple Green, and the rest is water. I have a giant bottle of it that I just keep refilling this with water. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the Simple Green and you're going to spray down where you're going to clean. What you want to do is you want to do, you want to clean like each spot that you clean you're going to spray. Clean it and then go on to the next spot. <clears throat> So, we're gonna spray this. 
that. As you saw earlier, I put, took my finger to it and it didn't move. So, we're gonna take the, the crappy, dingy sponge, scrubby side, and we are gonna scrub it down. Circular motions work best. Make sure you get in the corners and all that. Oops. Hmm. Scrubby, scrubby. <laughs> and then I have, because this thing is so big, ah, plastic cup. <laughs> You just fill it up. And rinse as you go, because if you do not, the the dirt that you just scrubbed off is gonna dry onto that and you're just gonna have to clean it again. So, we're just gonna rinse that off there. You might have to do it a couple times, but you shouldn't have to do it like over and over again. Um, if it's a really stubborn stain or it's been from or it's something that has been sitting for a really, really long time, um, just spray Simple Green onto it, scrub it, spray it again, let it sit no more than like five minutes come back with like a heavier duty or scrubbier and just scrub it again and rinse it off it should come off um so yeah that's my how-to video on how to do that if you have any questions please comment and um i should be doing more of these in the future mm.